That the another problem is his girlfriends. There are many. He have widows. He have divorcee. He have even someone that's in, in her husband's house. He's dating her. If I'm passing, they will be doing mockery of me. The other widow, we have fought in, our, in my parlor because of him. The other woman, she's from Nairi. Her, um, her husband is living with her. If I'm passing like this, the woman will come out of her shop and be telling me, hmm, that is what the woman will be telling me. And if I come back, I will still report him, say, look at what this woman is telling me. He will not take it serious. Rather, like he will go and be gingering them outside. The, the widow woman, her husband is late. She's a Yoruba woman, and her husband is from Nevi too. The woman is telling Biapalo, that is where he used to stay. Every day that he's coming back, he will first of all and go there before coming back. Sometimes he will come back 10, 11, 12. It depends. If he's not in, in her shop, he will be in her house. So if I'm passing, the woman be, be, will be mocking me. Oh, from, he normally go to the beer parlor, also go to the woman's house. Yes. Eh? Yes, sir. Her shop is very close to her house. It's opposite. No wonder. So I pack my things and leave his house for him. Since um, September... Now, he's asking me to come back. His family is involved in this case now. I refuse to come back, not until... But you slept yesterday in the bed. Yes, sir. It was on Sunday that one of his village brother came and reconciled... And that was my question. Daddy, the problem is that uh, since we got married, we have been having issue. And my husband has been married before. The wife is late. So he has two children. This is two years now that we married. The last year, the children wanted to come for holidays. I told him then he should allow the children for us to stay together. Ever since the children came, I have no peace in that home. I'm the one that went and looked for school for them. He chooses the school that they will start. Ever since then, if I buy clothes for the children, he will not be happy. Anything I do, he will not accept it. To the extent that he told the children that I'm not the one that gives birth to them, that their mommy is late. So this thing continues since August last year. And I have one baby, my first son, for him. That the problem has been going on to the extent that if I send the children, the children will not listen to me. If the children do anything wrong, if I report to him, he will not give me a listening ear. Ladder, he will leave, listen to his children. To the extent that he bought phone for the children, anything I do, the children will call him and report me to them to him. Every slightly mistake, he will start beating me. Last year, November, I took him for my second child for him. He asked me to go and remove it. I refused. He forced me. I refused. He said that in his, um, in his village, he's from Enugun, Kanu. He said that they have tradition that a, a married woman doesn't sleep outside. But he still, he's still accusing me of sleeping outside. To the extent that he said that he's not, he's not the one that pregnanted me, that I should go and remove it. I insisted of not removing it. This issue escalated to his family. To the extent his senior sister, she's against me. Every small thing, he will report me to his senior sister that I'm so wicked to the children, that I did this, I did that to where the children is. His first daughter is six years. She cannot sweep where they stay and eat. She cannot remove their plates that they use and eat. All these things, if I report to him, he will not believe it. Even himself, he will, if, any, if the children, any of the child did something bad, if I correct them, he will be like they are in their father's house. Whatever they like, they should do it, that I have no rights over them. That day, I'm tired of it. Every small thing, he will start beating me. He will start beating me. August, I was in labor. I told him to give me money, that I'm in labor, I'm having serious pain. He refused to give me money. He prepared his children for a lesson. He told the children not to eat my food again, that I will give them poison. <laughs> so I told him to give me money for transport. He refused. I insisted that he would give me my transport, that I want to go to hospital. It led to us to a fight. He started beating me. After beating me up, we, the street people, they gathered for us. After all said and done, he took me to the hospital. That was August 2nd. August 3rd, I gave birth to my daughter. The girl that he said that he's not the one that have it, 
that they are fam- then their village they have rules and regulation. Okay, I now said okay. Since they have rules and regulation in their village, if I will give birth, let their um, uh, rules hold me that he is not responsible for the child. So I pack my things and leave his house for him. Since um, September. Now, he's asking me to come back. His family is involved in this case now. I refuse to come back, not until... But you slept yesterday in the bed. Yes, sir. It was on Sunday that one of his village brother came and reconciled. And that was the my question. That's the answer. the Give a cab as in a bee, but it better than we are Now, give your demand for microphone. My name is Michael Ebo. I'm from Enugu State. Which Kano, local government? In Enkanu East local government. What is the problem you have with this woman? Daddy, this is my wife here. I married her in 2022. Wait till I can do like this. Uh, I married her 2022. And since when I married this girl, we are together and peaceful. How about your microphone, hello? But the problem is that if somebody that is not hearing advice, as I am now, I don't have any friend that can find me and come to my house. I'll tell you that I don't want to see any friends around my place. If you want to go and buy something, go outside and bought that and I'll come back. It's friend that can confuse you and deceive you for your marriage. And first of all, I have married before. These children that he's talking about, my first daughter is seven years now. In August 28, that is makes seven years. My son is six years. So if they are here now, you can ask them. So I never even tell them that this lady is not their mom. The first day this student came to my house, so she saw this, my wife, and be calling her auntie, auntie. I said, shut up, who is your auntie? He said, I'm daddy, who is the person? I said, ah, it's your mommy now. They begin to ask me, ah, is it that my first mommy that time? I said, yes. Since that time, two of them is calling her mommy. I don't know the, where this one is coming from. The reason that... What people, makes her to leave your home? She well, can't just pack her yes, things and leave. It's one morning, because sometimes, if I'm if I hungry like this, I may not talk to them. I will just keep quiet. Sometimes two days or three days. If you are, if you are the first like this, I feel no. Waiting, they make you verse. Now she calls them. Yes. Waiting, she do. Because sometimes, if I tell her something, she will not listen. Like what? For this time, this kind of friendship, too, and this, uh, she they seek advice from the mother, which is the that sister in Enugu. So all those things, as I now, two of his brother now, I brought them to Lagos to put them in order. Small time, one left, says she want to go and join Yahoo, Yahoo. I see brought the second one. And they're not going to tell me that they will not do the business. After I spend my money, finish, four, three months, they will just leave the place and go. So if I, if I want to report for their family, they will not even hear from me, except the one that I should tell them. Have you seen her with her man? No, sir. Have she stolen what belongs to you? No, sir. So what is her crime, I want to know? Is she, uh, how many children have you had for him? You have two. The late woman have two. What do you have, a boy or a girl? A boy and a girl. A boy, the first one have a, a boy and a girl. Uh-huh. So what is the problem? The, phone. the problem is that as I want to go market, uh, she told me that she wants to go and take an injection for the newborn baby. I gave her money before I left. So that morning, I was quarreling with her. At the same, some certain things. So she just keep quiet. After I left, go market. I then market you. She go give the baby injection. Come back. Come back all you look. Without fighting. We don't even fight. Except that quality that you have in that morning. Immediately after they come back, my daughter called me. Say, the mommy have go. I said, go where? I call her for phone. She blocked me. After she hear my voice, she can't call the phone and block my line. Yes, it's his phone. That time you left, do you carry your two kids? Yes, I, I go with my children and our luggages. Now, what is the thing he's doing to you you don't like? Daddy, he used to beat me. Okay, I, one. What again? He used to call me a shower. A shower. Yes, sir. Why will you marry a woman you don't trust? Did you ever? 
Oga, did you ever say to her that you are not the father of the baby when she was pregnant? No, sir. Don't lie to me before you run. Dad, I, I, I'm telling Nobody you. lies to me. I'm Don't lie. I'm telling you. The, the, see, the problem is that after she gets birth for the, my son, she pregnant. So I not tell her that. You know that this our baby is too small. Because of my son, that my son, they stop her blessed in three months because of the condition of his mother. Wait, she, when she was, when she finished giving birth, yes. she became pregnant again. Yes. So you asked her to go and remove it. No, I tell her that the only thing that I say that you know that she's in this too small. I know that even if Are you not the one that pregnant her? I'm the one. So why did you tell her to go and remove it? I don't say so, Daddy. Huh? That is what he said. He said I should go and buy peace and take the, for me to flush the baby. And I refuse. You refuse? Yes, sir. Um, if you have frustration, don't transfer aggression on an innocent woman. I don't see anything crime this woman is committing. If she's tired and the troubled, she needs to excuse herself. I don't support divorce. But somebody, you yeah, a microphone. Somebody cannot come. If your first wife died, you, you should have stayed without marrying anybody. It, you, you don't commit any sin. That time she died, you remain with your boy and the uh, girl. For you to go and marry another person, he must stand and not transfer aggression. If you go to market, if he did not sell, if you come, you'll be chatting at her. Tell, calling your wife at Shawo, telling her to go and do abortion, but you are the one sleeping with her. Yesterday night, she, first day she came, it was only about in her room. Daddy, another problem is his girlfriends. There are many. He have widows. He have divorcee. He have even someone that's in, in her husband's house. He's dating her. If I'm passing, they will be doing more of me. The other widow, we have fought in, our, in my parlor because of him. The other woman, she's from Newi. Her, um, her husband is living with her. If I'm passing like this, the woman will come out of her shop and be telling me, hmm, I put her bed on you and catch her full noah. That is what the woman will be telling me. And if I come back, I will still report him, say, look at what this woman is telling me. He will not take it serious. Rather, he will go and be gingering them outside. The, the widow woman, her husband is late. She's a Yoruba woman, and her husband is from Newi too. The woman is selling beer parlor. That is where he used to stay. Every day that he's coming back, he will first of all and go there before coming back. Sometimes he will come back 10, 11, 12. It depends. If he's not in, in her shop, he will be in her house. So if I'm passing, the woman be, be, will be more creamy. Oh, from, he normally go to the beer parlor. I also go to the woman's house. Yes. Eh? Yes, sir. Her shop is very close to her house. It's opposite. No wonder. The, the, the woman, the woman. Oga, it's okay. It's okay. No, 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 peace. Stay away from your girlfriends. You cannot eat your cake and have it. Men should be responsible for once. What are you eating in the beer parlor that your wife cannot cook for you? Oh, you know that so. He wants her to die like the other one. Daddy, that's what he said. He, he told me that if anything should happen to me, it's not his first time that he's had married before and the wife is late. So if my enemy should die, he's not the first thing for him. Want? Uh -huh. Oga, stay away from why. Bring this lady close. Pet her. Listen to her. Two of you should work together and be the family. Stay away from Biapalo. No peace in alcohol. That the organ of Biapalo now go and see number show. Now you, I feel my hand in a no broya want to baramia. That the the reason why we are here now is that my children is not with me. After I left his house, I took my children to East, and I came back for me to start a job and start my life afresh. You will enjoy what you can. of your brothers 
my senior brother is here in Lagos. My junior ones are in the east. I want to see your brother before I will conclude this. That's your brother. Is, is he your older? Is he yes, older than you? Yes. Let him come. Let me see three of them before I can tell her to go back to you. If you know things that your wife are complaining that she don't like, if you marry a woman, give her some respect so that your prayer will not be hindered. That is what the Bible says. And I know that doing this piece is not for you to take style to have the access with the children. That, that is the more reason why I'm here. If you do that, if you do that, maybe if she bring the children now, you grab her and push her away. That, that is the reason why I'm here. That is what my If you do that, Kebon and Raya. Anytime you're having problem with your wife, your business will begin to cry. People don't know this. Whenever there is trouble in the family to begin to affect children, children will begin to fail exams. Your wife is like a goddess in the family. The Bible says, treat them with understanding. Why the Bible mentioned understanding? Because you, a man, cannot do without washing your hair. But she can carry her hair three months without pouring it to water. It should in their home. Treat them with understanding. At the age of 80 years, they still want a man that paid them. Women is weaker vessel. It's chill wine. And a minimum Put your other women aside. Face your wife. Eh? I have done that. Sir. Which day can you put your girlfriends? Do them away. So many HIV positive cases here. It is always men that bring it and give their wife. So many ladies I know, married women I know, having hepatitis B and HIV. If I'm doing investigation, I notice that most of them contacted it through their, their husband. Men who cheat a lot and they don't know the implication of cheating. It's always bring disaster in a marriage, in a family. Side chicks will end up sidelining your destiny. Are you, are you also training the other, the late woman children very well? Daddy, we are living together, yes. I do my best. If you are coming tomorrow, I want to see that too. Hello? If you are coming tomorrow, I want to see the two children of that late wife. Happy, how do you go? How do you go? How do you go? How do you go? It's okay. When you are coming tomorrow, bring them. You are taking care of them well? Yes, sir. You are buying clothes for them? That they used to buy on December last year. There should be no difference between the way you take care of your two kids and that woman's children. Daddy, there is no difference. So that God will not be angry with Daddy, you. Daddy, I never uh, make them to know there is a separation between two of them. On December last year, he gave me 20,000 to go and buy clothes for them. But out of my own money, I still bring out 20,000 naira. How can and he give you 20,000 to buy clothes? That is what, that is, he kept money at home. He told me to take 20,000 Which clothes will the 20,000 buy? That is look at him here. He told me to take 20,000 naira from there. Is he coming to prayer here? Daddy, I'm the one that dragged him here since we have this problem. Since I left his house, I told him to start coming if he wants me to come back. Okay, let me see your brother tomorrow. And if you are coming, come with your two children, the first two. Huh? Responsible. I don't like divorce. I preached against it last night. But a man should be responsible. Family that stay together. That pray together, stay together. See you tomorrow in my office after tomorrow program. God bless you, people.